You just don't want to have to trim anything. That's right. <laughs> Everybody. We're in the backyard today. A uh, neighbor was just over. We were having a chat. I guess they're going to do fireworks this year. Yeah. If the weather holds. That's Sam Wayne. Sam Wayne, yeah. Yeah. Well, this is the first time in a long time, I guess. So maybe we will go. I don't know if they do the. I am happy to be outside. I found out one thing that helps with depression. You need to have the equipment that does not have a hole in it so that you're not getting enough oxygen when you're up and around. I was like, I was in the kitchen, I was like running out of breath so easy. And I had this in, and it's like I kept feeling this air. And it's like, okay, something's not right here. And sure enough, my green tubing had a slit in. It happens to that green tubing every so often. And it had a little slit in it just right past my cannula. I'm on my portable right now. Once I got some good oxygen, I was feeling a lot better. <laughs> Yeah, she woke me up at 3 o'clock in the morning. Yes, I did. It was like... It was like, Joe, get up! I need some... I need new hookups hook here. But I did call and order some new stuff today, too. So... <laughs> He's picking the paint that he's got on our new picnic table. It's my workbench at home. Or outside frame. So they're dry. Yeah. I don't mind. Just put a cloth or something under it. I don't know. Then you'll be stuck to the cloth. He can get it off. He just has to use a scratcher pad or something. Right now he's trying to use his fingernails for the big drops that works. <laughs> if you let me show you what he's doing. His hands were made before scrubber pads, right? <laughs> oh, they're getting the right view. I can't tell I'm not looking at the lens. Hey, what mining? Here, we'll do it this way, that way. No, I still get out of, I can still get out of frame. <laughs> oh, well. There's one there. I can't reach it very well. Short arms. You're short all over. <laughs> yeah, even my pinkies. That was fun playing the guitar. when your finger picking it's kind of nice to have that little long pinky that you can sit you know can rest against the deal and keep you from keep you in the rhythm but I just had to do it on my own you tell them that I mowed the yard over there no I I didn't we've got a neighbor over here that doesn't always come and mow their yard. <laughs> Let's it get pretty well, darn long. Nobody lives there. No, but it does have an owner. But the owner doesn't take care of it. So no. I got tired of looking at the grass that was a foot and a half tall. Yep. So yesterday I went over there and started, and the neighbor guys come over and help me, and got it cleaned up. And... Yep. They did a good job. It looks much better. Now that it's mowed, I, I feel of, like we ought to, but ought to send them a bill for something. 
Just to let them know, hey. Well, they, well, them guys used to mow a long time. They just got tired of it. Well, why should they come and mow it when everybody else is doing it for them? Yeah. For free. It's still not nice. You wouldn't do that to somebody. No. Not intentionally. I just got tired of looking at it. Oh, we all do. Besides that, you get that really long grass and stuff, and then you start getting a lot of, oh, grasshoppers and snakes. Well, I don't Did you see any snakes? I wouldn't think so. Dwayne, well, maybe garter snakes sometimes. Dwayne, Dwayne saw uh, snakes can over his flower garden. Yeah. Gets, he gets a little garter Well, snake. as they grow, they shed. He gets a little garter snake over there once in a while. Garter snakes are okay. Especially if they eat mice and corn snakes. But the thing is, the bad, and we, I don't know if we have any up here. Kansas, they do. There's a, there's a king snake. It resembles a rattlesnake, but it doesn't have a. It'll po poke its tail up and start doing this, but you won't hear anything because there's no rattle. But a lot of times they do get killed because you see them from the front end, and you you think rattlesnake, and you don't. But they are they ki they kill other snakes. Yeah, some snakes are good to have around, but. There's snakes you don't want to. But yeah, there's some, there's some that aren't, they're um, immune to all of their snake poisons. I'm sure, that, I think the king snake is one. But yeah. Oh, it's nice to be outside. So, what, in the comments, um, what can I ask him? Oh, about snakes. <laughs> Do you have a favorite kind of snake and why? I don't. I don't. He don't like any snake. No. The good one is a dead one. So a <laughs> <laughs> well, you know what? There's a lot less mice because of them. Yeah. And spiders will eat other bugs. I don't like spiders either. I know. I, if they're in my way, I'll kill them. <laughs> if they're in the house, I'll kill them. It is. It is a pain in the. In the it's a pain when. <laughs> Excuse me. We, our garage at the old place. It seemed like for some reason, and I don't know. That darn spider, there would always be a spider that would go web from the from the garage over to a tree. And it would spin back and forth. And you, it was so fine, you didn't see it. And you'd walk right into it, stuck to your face. Mm -hmm. And ew, then you're trying to pull this crap off your face. That spider I didn't like. But I couldn't find it. Yeah. <laughs> Where's our corn and squirrel? Mm -hmm. Oh, you put it somewhere else. Yeah. But there's no squirrels going to eat it right now because they like to eat it in the morning or when they don't see us. Oh, there's a squirrel up on the power line. Power line, yeah. You've got a nice wide line to walk there for. Just uh, running across there, or having a nice little leisurely walk. Because <laughs> she hasn't last. Well, after he passed away, she's like, I don't know really what to do with this place. <laughs> so anyway, the next door neighbor, um, he got stranded out on in a really, really super. Sub zero day. It was, I don't know, 20 something below or more. And he got out of his car, probably got disoriented. Why he got out of the car, nobody knows. 
But they said he has a tendency to like to get out of the car and sit on the curb. And I don't know what possessed him if he was... Well, he was going to try and walk. Yeah, he wanted to walk. To some place, and then he's, he had bad knees. And he... Yeah, so anyway. He sat down and he got frostbit and ended up losing both legs. Yep. And eventually dying from septic. <laughs> yeah. Well, usually these flies start biting, it means that it's going to rain. So the forecast may have had it too. I don't even see a cloud in the sky, but well, there's some starting over there. When you said it's raining out west. Yeah, that usually comes this way. It usually moves. Although the other day they had one moving from the thing was kind of doing that circle deal. Hook echo, <laughs> I guess. But it wasn't tornado weather. It was just a lot of rain. And um, it pushed it west instead of east. It was kind of weird. <laughs> I don't know why it, you know, does that. I mean, we get wind from just about every direction, but it just seems like storms usually come from the east. This is nice. It is. It's nice to be out here. Maybe when we have some nice days, the kids are up, they can do a little football or a little soccer or something. That's what we used to do. But I'm past football, touch or any kind. One thing we used to play when we were young was kick the can. Yeah. You ever play that? Yeah. And it had to be played after dark. And whoever kicked the can, how was that? Whoever kicked the can was it? I don't remember. But played hide and seek. And yeah, it was like a hide and seek game. Um, if you got to where you could kick the can before they caught you, then you you beat them. But yeah, my ankle. I got one bite, but that's about it. They like you. You're sweet. Usually. <laughs> Do it when it's really muggy or if it's gonna rain. Yeah. Well, there. I don't smell rain, but there's a hint of moisture in the air. So, anyway. <laughs> oh. Now, when her bushes bloom, this is a. That's just very pretty in her yard. I wouldn't mind having them. One or two bushes like that. <laughs> Rose bushes are bad enough. You just don't want to have to trim anything. That's right. <laughs> the, there are some that you don't have to trim. These you do. Otherwise they look stupid. Okay. <laughs> hey, I got the rose bushes out of him. I'm getting the irises and the tulips out of him, so I'm just going to kind of hold off on anything else for a while. Well, I don't know where you'd put something like that. I don't know in the front, is it? No, it'd have to be in the backyard, but... That's just it, right? <laughs> you don't want to put anything in the backyard. I don't ever want to get something too ready around the gas pipes. I know. Sewer. Well, you just have to... You have to <coughs> find out where they are. Well, I know where they are. So we can't, I don't really want to plant them. But okay. I got the rose bush close enough to the gas. Well, I rose bush, I don't think it gets roots that deep. Mm -hmm. Ah, we're going to argue on camera. How about that? Yeah. <laughs> uh, I think Pastor Tom, when he were when they were here, he had a, I think it was a corn snake. And I held, I handled it a bit, got to hold it a bit. But at the time, because he knew how much Nina liked white mice and white rats, which I don't. 
but <laughs> he he would feed it when it was due to be fed. He, it, the, he'd get these little dead white mice, and that's what he would feed it. They would be in the freezer until it was time to feed it. Ow, now I am getting bit. You're sending them over to me. Is, that, is, that, is there ants down here anywhere? No, they are, but you see that fly right there? He's yeah. biting me right now. Yeah. It, we still got some... Still got some walnuts from the old walnut tree. Yeah. Yeah, we got rid of ours. Well, I think maybe we ought to go in before Joe loses all of his blood to, to flies. Yeah. <laughs> before I get mad, start cussing. No, you don't do that. We love you. <laughs> yeah, stupid thing. Please comment below and subscribe and like. I think we're worth it. <laughs> we'll see you again on Monday. Love you all. Good night.